What's up, everybody? And welcome back to the channel. Today we're on Epic Seven. Yes, I'm on Epic Seven. Do we just release the leader? They just released the leader of uh, Dagger Sakar Eligos, and uh, also with a drop rate up for Lua. So these are two extremely well. Lua most definitely is a good character all around. Not sure how Eligos look. Let's go ahead and check him out and see what he got on his uh, kit and stuff. So. Got a basic type, point blank range, gets perception, increases uh, you know, critical chance and critical damage. Uh, for his passive, he has the cleaner. When ally when the ally except for the caster defeats the enemy, increases the attack of the caster. So his Oh, I like that actually. Because sometimes you have those 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 attacks that just don't clearly clean up your character up increases his attack and then he activates a bomb on them basically uh time bomb attacks the enemy with the bomb that grants perception to the caster so he gets his kids perception up so it seemed like he would work good in pretty good team so far i don't know love for the family him and his family always come first business is secondary so that's that's his um dispatch mission thing. And then we have Cloak and Trigger. Attacks the enemy with his pistol, dispelling two debuffs before inflicting the target. Let's go ahead and preview the skills. Um my sound is off because I I have been grinding, but let's just go ahead and show his basic attack. Oh that boy kicks. He kicks him and then punch, then uh, shoots at him. Alright, let's do this right here. This is his special. It's like, don't run up on Daggers the car, bro. I'm, I'm gonna have to get in your butt on that. And this one does have a, a burn effect on it. I forgot to tell you that one, but yeah. I wonder if that claw mark on his face is from a cat or is it from one of his hunts he was on? I mean, we will find out, I guess, because he does have a side story going on too, or they do have a side story going on. Wait. Not there. Uh, this whole side story thing be messing me up now. Oh, is it not? It might not be active just yet. Because it would have been right here on this list with this one. But, yeah, 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 yeah. It would have been on that list with that one. So, yeah. That's Elgos, guys. Um, don't see it, man. I don't know how he's going to be. If you think he's going to be good, guys, let me know. Most time, Rangers come in the game. They're pretty decent. At least they go, they they'll be useful in some kind of way, but oh, we forgot to talk about his um his um his artifact. Where's his artifact? Excuse me. An offer you cannot refuse. Uh, can I look at it? There it is, right there. When attacking with a single attack, penetrates the target's defense. When defeating an enemy with a single attack, increases the combat risk of an ally with the highest combat. I kind of like it. You probably could use this on somebody else that's on the team with him and probably get more use out of it, honestly. But I think it should work with him too. Anyway, guys, if you like the video, don't forget to like, subscribe. Tell me if you're going to pull for him or not, or if you're skipping because we did have um, news about. Let's go up here in the news events. I think we're supposed to have um, Artifact Leica coming out. Uh, I don't see it on this one. I I'll have to go deep into the stove to see that. But let me know if you're going to pull for him. Tell me if you if that's the character you've been waiting on. Because like, I always thought he was a cool character in the story. But I mean, we don't know if he's going to be stronger. I bet his Awakening version, or I say Awakening, but his other his starlight version would be better but we'll see anyway guys that's all for the video see ya